Inside the labs at 23andMe in Mountain View, technicians are processing thousands of saliva samples, all of them from people who used their take-home kit to get genetic information about their ancestry or health. The test that we offer is a great way for those people to get access to this information directly without having to get a prescription. Now for the first time, the FDA is allowing the Mountain View company to test for BRCA mutations. They are applicable primarily to people who have Ashkenazi Jewish ancestry, so that's an important limitation of the test. 23andMe only tests for three possible mutations that are only seen in a very small percentage of the population. Something medical ethics professor David Magnus worries will confuse at home users. People will misunderstand and believe that because they test negatively, that is, they do not test positive for any of the three BRCA genes that are being tested by the company, that that means that they've got a clean bill of health. He worries someone could still have another one of the thousands of BRCA genes that aren't covered by the take home kit. So for some people who might be getting this test, it, it may be harder to really under, interpret and understand those results. But company representatives say it's something they've already worked through with the FDA. For some people who might be getting this test, it, it may be harder to really under, interpret and understand those results. The testing kit will be available on the 23andMe website within the next couple of weeks. The cost? $199. In Mountain View, Katie Nielsen, KPIX5.